What's up guys, Anush is here and welcome to our new series of vlogs, Expert Talks, where we are going to host experts and speak about various topics related to video marketing and not only. And today we have Tatev at the studio. Hey everyone, I'm Tatev from Crisp, an AI powered noise cancellation app for remote meetings. So buckle your seatbelts because today we are going to talk about how to do keyword research for YouTube videos. But first subscribe to our YouTube channel to not miss our upcoming expert talks. Think back the last time you wanted to know something. You had it straight to Google, right? Now think about what did you do the last time you wanted to learn something. You probably went to YouTube and you are not alone. So why is YouTube keyword strategy so important? Millions of people use YouTube search every day to find various videos about cooking, marketing, business, just everything. In other words, it's most likely that someone from your target audience is looking for one of your videos. So if you can identify the keyword they are using in their search and you can optimize your video around that keyword, your video will appear at the top of search results. Keyword research for videos is completely different from text-based content. Is it time consuming? Uh, no, I don't think so. Uh, in general, keyword research doesn't have to be time consuming or frustrating. Uh, so let me show you some uh, basic tips on how to do keyword research for your next videos. One of the simplest ways to find a keyword for your next YouTube video is YouTube suggest or YouTube autocomplete function. You simply type a keyword in the search field and YouTube is showing up all the keywords people are searching for. So it's obviously easier to rank for long tail keywords rather than short ones. Even though the field is considerably smaller, there are some tools made specifically for YouTube keyword research and almost all of them offer some free trials and here are some of them. HyperSuggest shows you the first 10 results without any account, uh, but it shows the potential search volume and also expands the results based on prefixes, suffixes and modifiers. Word Tracker provides search volume, competition and information about the number of time the keyword appears and that's with the free trial. Instead of starting from scratch, why not see which keywords your competitors are targeting? For that, you will need a tiny Chrome extension called vidIQ. Along with other helpful features, my favorite part about vidIQ is the ability to see which uh, tags are using your competitors in their videos. This is a great way to find different keywords uh, just in a few minutes. For example, when I searched for video marketing on YouTube, I quickly found a bunch of different keywords just in a few minutes. Actually, I used vidIQ free version and now I'm shifting to pro one because of that app. <laughs> Pretty cool. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but you know what makes uh, vidIQ especially helpful? That you can get data in the, uh, for each keyword, like how many times that keyword is searched, how competitive it is. Your YouTube analytics is a keyword research goldmine. That's because YouTube is showing you all the exact keywords people are using to find your videos. To find this report, just simply go to YouTube Studio Analysis and Reach Viewers. Uh, in most cases, we are finding the keywords that we are already optimizing for. Uh -huh. But that's, that's a good sign. It means that your video SEO efforts are already paying off. Mm, that's good. Search intent, also called user intent, is uh, the content that the user wants to see when they type certain keyword. So, for example, when they type buy wireless headphones, they have purely commercial intentions. They want to buy he headphones. But when they uh, type, uh, can headphones cause hearing loss? They don't have any commercial intentions. They just want to get informed. This is called informational intent. So when you are doing keyword research for your next video, simply think instead of your user, what they want to see in your video, what they want to do, what action they want to take. They want to get converted or just get informed. Well, we can talk about YouTube keyword research for hours. And I'm sure you will have a bunch of questions. If so, just drop them in the comments below and Tata will reply to all of them personally. Thanks for joining me today. Catch you guys on the next vlog. Bye.